the heck? Wait, is this a new set? It is, but I don't know who did it. It wasn't us. No, it wasn't. Dude, no, it wasn't. No, no, no! Oh, whoa. What the? Ah, 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 episode of Can We DIY? Let's, Let's find out! This series watch other people's DIYs and try to do it ourselves. And for today's DIY, we're going to be making a mini soda can grill. Before we get started, make sure you guys follow us on all of our social medias. We have Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat. And make sure to like and subscribe so you can keep up with all the videos we'll be posting. All right, let's watch the video. Shout out to The Q for this DIY amazing mini barbecue from Coca-Cola Can at Home video. We're gonna skip to the end and see what this thing looks like. Oh. What? That's legit. Easy. All right. Oh, that's a bomb. And he has mini tongs too. Oh. All right, let's see if we can do this. All right, so for today's episode, since we're making barbecue grill, we're gonna be Dance. Dance. How's it going? I'm Pete. Oh, I'm Jimmy. What do you do, Jimmy? I'm a little surfboarder uh, dad that cooks burgers for his children. Wow, that's amazing. I run a computer software company. We're called Triple Entity for you. Basically, we just run a bunch of computers and softwares. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I'm just a bum. I don't, I don't think. Do I have kids? Kids? For some reason, you look Italian. I know, I look Italian. <laughs> Me too, I'm a little bit Italian also. <laughs> hey, we're about to get the ingredients out now, right? I love me some ingredients. You know, back home, I actually use a lot of ingredients in my uh, in my stew. I like cooking stew for my son named Stu, right. and my daughter named Stewie, right. and we have another child named Bob. Okay, let's go ahead and get out these ingredients. All right, all right. So here we got some legs for the grill, some U-bolts. We also got a handle for the grill. We got some extra screws. Screws. I like screwing, right? What do you screw? Like computers? Yes. You know, you gotta fix them, right? Yes, I gotta right, fix yeah. a lot of computers, lots of computers. Yeah, I, I screw men. I keep making like screwdriver drinks, you know? Oh, the wow. good stuff that gets them drunk. Are you a bartender? No, I don't oh. know what I am. Hmm. Kids? And we got some door hinges. I like door hinges. They remind me of some of the software we make back in our company, Triple Entity for You. What we use are hinges that connect the two softwares together and make sort of a door to open up new softwares. Wow, kind of like the laptop. Right. That's pretty much what I was explaining. Yes. Oh, uh, we got two rods. This is gonna be for the grill. We have the Hawaiian bread. The uh, little smokies. Little I don't smokies. know why I'm laughing right now, Pete. You look good. That's why. <laughs> we have our kickstart. We have another kickstart can because, well, probably gonna mess up. Yep. Then we have ketchup, and then we have rubbing alcohol. Rubbing alcohol makes me a little tipsy. Yeah, we don't do beer at this barbecue. We do isopropyl alcohol. We like the hard stuff, just yeah. like what the kids say. It's um, going to be lit. We also got charcoal. I think first we need to drink this. Uh, I don't think I can drink this. It's bad for my uh, cholesterol. I'm a freelancer, so I can drink whatever I want. Freelancer. <laughs> <laughs> What does freelancing have to do with anything? Does that mean like I'm a free soul? <laughs> Close enough, man. Doesn't Dietrich do something with this where like when he drinks it, music starts or something? I don't know, maybe try it out. But you know we got the antidote. Well, wow. I didn't know you are a dancer. Yeah, you know, back in my day, I used to be known as Poynton McGee. I used to be the, the tipper. And they give me money, but then I put it back in my hat and it kind of falls in it, but it's all right. You know, I see, saw the kids doing this move one time. It's called the whip. Oh, right. You take your hand and you just whip it. Oh, wow. Whip it. Wow. I'm pretty tired after that. I'm really winded. You need cardio in your life. Come join me in freelancing. <laughs> so time for the first step. What's that? Cut this in half. I've oh, done nice. it. Nice. And flabbergasted. Wow. Okay, next we're just gonna cut little edges right here so we can fold it. So here we're just gonna fold the uh, the edges in. We put a little creases in there. Wow, that's nifty. That's a nice looking unibrow. Yes. 
been growing it for 37 years and I'm 35. Now we gotta put the legs in. We're gonna use these bad boys as the legs. Is that too big? What do you think? Oh, it might be too big. That's what I was saying. Or we're gonna have to improvise. Okay, we'll make it work somehow. We'll make it work. We're just gonna put the whole U-bolt right over and put this other bracket right there and close it off with some thing of things. We got the U-bolt put in this bracket and we're just gonna close it up right there. And what one guy I saw did is he pulled these apart. Let's try it. Oh, wow, you're strong. Oh, it did work. Like I always say, if it works, it, it works. works. Wow, that's gonna work real good. Not as stable as we want. Oh, it's stable when you do that. See, look at that. Move the table, it's all, it's all right good. Now we just gotta measure out where the hinge is gonna go. All right, so we're gonna put one hinge right there. Guys, we're just gonna do one right in the middle. We're just gonna mark it so we know how where to make a hole. Looks like two eyes. That's definitely two eyes right there. Maybe four. Are you calling me four eyes? I will not take bullying from you, mister. If y'all have some power tools, this will be the best. Oh, we did it. Time to put the hinge on. Let's get hingy, right kids? Get hingy, is that what you guys say now? All right, so there's the first screw. First screw is in. All right, there's the hinge. Wow. Looks good. So it's our little handle. Ooh, it's kind of heavy. It's so heavy, are you sure you can handle it? <sighs> oh. Teamwork! Makes a dream work. All right, so we got the screw right in here. Now we're just gonna put the little handle on. And there is our handle. Wow! Oh! oh too heavy? Perfect. We gotta make the, the grill, right? Yes. So guys, we're just gonna sand it down because like the dirt's coming off it. That's kind of nasty. Oh, oh dude, I, I'm so sorry there, Pete. I did not mean to get that close to you. You could have took my noggin off. Good thing I have health insurance. Your turn to polish that bad boy. Oh, oh sorry. Wow, you almost took my noggin <laughs> off. Do you have health insurance? I do not. You know what, I think this is just gonna be a forever dirty. <laughs> yeah, it's all right. All right, so how should we do this? If you wanna grip it and then we'll teamwork it. Fold it over there. Yeah. There we go. Let's see if that's a... Uh, that oh! oh, perfect. All right, guys, so this is kind of ghetto, but it's gonna work. Grill right there, close, open, and we're just gonna have to hold it, because if you let go, it's gonna break. Uh-oh. Okay, time to put the coals in. Oh, wow. Wow, there's already gasoline on each of these charcoal pieces. Really? Yeah. That's sketchy. So do we even need a alcohol? We do not. Go ahead and put this in. Okay, kids, so, so far we have the charcoal in here. Yeah, I like it. It's pretty nifty. Once we put it on fire, it's getting pretty lit. <laughs> so lit. I'm gonna get the bread cut up so it's nice and to its size. I'm gonna eat that. Mm. Oh, yes. That's good bread. You want some? Yes, I definitely need some. Yeah. Mm. Oh my, this is complete fabric action. You know what I like to do with my Hawaiian bread? I like to squish it up and then eat it like this. All right, so here are the buns. You see that little hot dog buns? They look good, right? Little babies. That looks funny on camera. So here we're just gonna slice and dice. And that's good, because I like eating mice. We're gonna light this now, guys. It's kind of scary. And it's time to light it up and get lit. I love getting lit. I, I am so. so scared. Oh, snap. What's going on? Yeah, just, there you wow. go. Wow. All right, here is the charcoal. It's on fire. It's pretty lit right now. It's very lit. So you see that the charcoal's kind of turning gray? Wow. That's what you want all of it to do. <laughs> oh! 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 My nostril blew some of the smoke and fire in Pete's mouth. We made a little grill. It's working. I'm really excited. All right, do you want to do the honors green and put it in? Yes. Oh, oh it's you cooking. hear the sizzle. Here is our 2017 family barbecue. Wow. That looks good. 20 minutes later. I think our wieners are ready. Oh, I love me some wieners. Let's check on it. Wow, that looks amazing. That looks delicious. Let's do it. Oh, wow, that's sketchy. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Nice. Wow. Nice. That's in real nice. Here we go. Oh, too much. That one squirted a little too much. We got our little french fries, and why not top it off with some miniature Mountain Dews? Mm. And here we have our miniature dinner.
go ahead and cheers to our mini grill. To our mini grill and our mini foods. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. That tastes like a hot dog. This is complete flabbergaston. I cannot believe we did it. This is the best mini meal ever. I'm almost done with it already. I think I need like 10 more. Mm-hmm. That is real good with the Hawaiian bread. Mm-hmm. I guess the question is, can we DIY? Yes, we can! Thank you guys for joining us on this DIY. Make sure you comment when you guys want the next DIY. And we will see you guys next time. You mean like this?